Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome to the final part of my Spring Hill Suite speed furnishing series. This part is not a furnishing part, this is actually the house tour. Uh, I did change some things uh, in between episodes of the furnishings. So some things that were in the furnishing videos may be a little bit different now. Uh, not a whole lot has changed, but I just thought it would be nice for you guys to see the whole thing all put together, as opposed to just the individual room furnishings. So here's the exterior of the house. Not really that great exterior, so I, I just tried something really simple. I just gave it some some blue walling with some stone like some grayish brown tannish stone accents and we also did some greenery and some foliage out here as well not really too too great with the whole foliage thing so here we just have some um what are these called bushes Hedges, yes, hedges. So we just have some hedges here and some red flowers and some stones aligning it, as well as like walls and half walls and such. And then over here we have a beautiful flower bed, our lovely male lady, and some more hedges around the side here. Now coming along the back here, as soon as you turn from the side of the house, we have one little porch right here with just a bench and uh, some poles keeping the roofing stable. We have some more half walls which are also secluding our outdoor pool entertainment area. And here is a quick tour of our pool. So we just have some chairs sit in right here, a nice our pool of course, a diving board, some more chairs, a grill, um, a juice keg. And then over to the far left, we just have a slip and slide. Alrighty, but now we are back around at the front here and we'll start at the entrance, our foyer area. All right, here is uh, the main view of our foyer area. We just have a rug on the ground, which kind of is a little bit glitchy. I'll probably get rid of that, but you know, it's there for now. Uh, we have a fish tank right here, which we should probably put some fish in. Uh, that that would be a good idea. Um, and on the left side, when you first walk in, we also have a painting here of this, this really elegant painting. Um, and then a side table or an end table or whatever this is called but it's really nice and it's from the sims 3 store if we move further back into the foyer we have this really nice couch here from seasons a another end table from the sims 3 store and then some custom content flowers which are very very lovely you guys probably already saw them but we also have some stairs here so uh those are always nice <laughs> to have We'll go ahead and just take a right turn into our dining room, which is this room right here. Uh, yeah, my Sims are nasty and they need to clean up after themselves, but here's our little dining table. Uh, we have a very bright white theme. The table is from Ambitions and the chairs are from Showtime. And the teeny little purple plant is from the High End Loft Stuff Pack. We have this nice uh, ceiling lamp that is from Seasons and right behind it we have another fish tank which I believe is either from the base game or from a late night, one of the two. We have some nice artwork and wall decals displayed in this room as well as a little bit of greenery. If we go ahead and proceed into the room to the right, uh, we get into the kitchen. In the kitchen, I changed up the walls to make them all this super bright yellow color. It's hard to see because the lights are off right now. Oh, and I forgot to mention that I changed the walls in the living room to this uh, sort of pinky purplish color as well. So they're not blue anymore. But back to the kitchen, I really, really love this room. We just have a coffee table and some chairs up front, uh, some bar stools and an island counter in the middle, and then our main kitchen appliances in the back. I'll just give a quick tour through it all. So if we 
come through the dining room here into the foyer, straight on through the foyer to the living room. When you first enter the living room, to the right you see this coffee table with a adorable little rose decor item. This is custom content. And then we have some wall lamps, which are from Late Night. If you proceed, we have a little bar area, uh, some little counters, uh, a wine rack, and this nice miscellaneous wall decor items as well. So we have a very vibrant neon light sort of deal here and an abstract sort of space looking art decal right here. And then of course our bar. And a rug. <laughs> Can't forget about the rug. <laughs> Past the bar, we have this little nook area, which is just has a shelf and some miscellaneous decor pieces as well. So we just have some trophies uh, and this little llama statue. <laughs> we all know the Sims and llamas. And then, of course, I just displayed some artwork above that, and then I put a plant below. I separated the bar from the rest of the living room with a little half wall. If we turn more to the right, we will see the rest of the living room. So right here we have a dominoes table where your sims can just play some dominoes for kicks. To the left we see a little lounge chair and another coffee table with some magazines. Then we finally get to our entertainment area which has a really nice and fun modern looking lamp here. Our neck, right behind our sectional couch, we have a nice wooden circular coffee table as well with the same uh, custom content flower decor pieces that we saw in the foyer. I also included this chair which came from Seasons and had that be an additional piece of our entertainment area. I also switched up the rug and made it this blue grayish color combination and the entertainment area is still the same with the bookshelves and shelves and all the fun little knickknacks placed on there. Over here we just have a fun little music area. We just have a rack of CD and a fun little modernized stereo along with this neat little painting of a flower. If we go into this room right off of the living room, we enter the very first bedroom. This bedroom is mainly late night and high and loft stuff, so if you want anything in the bedroom, check those two packs. That is all for the first floor, so now we will go ahead and continue up the second level. When you come up the stairs, this is the first thing you see. We have these really nice purple walls that go all the way around this hallway. Starting to the left of the hall, we have this nice decor area with this ottoman, a plant, another coffee table with the same red rose, and once again, a nice wide open window to open up the space. If we continue over to the right, we see a little bookshelf, another painting, uh, some nice, very elegant seats, the same coffee table, and also the same flowers that we have seen a couple times throughout the first floor. Starting with this bedroom, we are going to take a look, see at what's inside. This is the master bedroom. The color theme is royal red, purples, black, and white. Adjacent to the walk-in closet, we have a bathroom, so this is the master bathroom right here. But the theme in here is the same as the bedroom. An elegant bathtub. This is a very, very expensive bathtub. It was like 2,000 simoleons. Like, why would you pay that much money for a bathtub? But, <laughs> okay. 